I'm in Recordable, which which records uh, screen um, screencasts or screen recordings on an Android phone, and the phone doesn't have to be uh, rooted. It's just it can be a standard one, although you have to go through connection procedure. One of the things uh, this nice feature is if I um, click on a um, a recording that I've done, and I have uh, TextMyth Fuse app connected, I can share my video to Fuse, and then because I have Snagit for Mac, I can send it to Snagit for Mac. Now, the first time I do this, I have to go through a connection procedure, connect to Snagit, and if I'm on my Mac, I go to File, Connect Mobile Device, that brings up a Q QR code, and then with my mobile phone, I connect to Snagit. That brings up a dialog box, and if I bring that down over the QR code, my video then immediately starts, depending the size, how and it's being sent over the internal Wi-Fi system. That video then is loaded across to Snagit. For a moment I thought my Wi-Fi had gone down for a moment there. That wouldn't be unsurprising. And then the video comes across into Snagit. One of the newer features in Snagit for Mac is this ability to drag your timeline on a video and let's take it to say the QR code piece. There we go, there's a QR code and I want to capture that frame. I just click the capture frame button and then I have a still frame from the video and, and then I can um, let's say I wanted to crop off the top of the screen and uh, I can crop off the bottom of the screen and if I wanted to add a text box onto there and put some text in I could uh, do that so it's a very nice feature the ability to send a screen recording f using TechSmith Fuse directly into Snagit and take screenshots out of the videos that I've recorded on my mobile phone.